Hello. Um, so this is the uh, instruction video for downloading AutoCAD Mechanical 2020. Um, so first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to go going to want to go to this website here, uh, Autodesk.com uh, ed slash education slash free dash software slash AutoCAD uh, dash mechanical. Um, when you go to this website, it'll uh, allow you to download AutoCAD. Uh, as a student, now, AutoCAD is a very expensive software, uh, but it's free for students and educators. So we want to make sure we download the proper one. Um, if you scroll down, you'll see the option to sign in. If you've already created an account, you can sign in there. Uh, if you have not, you will create an account. Do not go to this part that says not a student or educator. Get the free trial because uh, that's a limited trial run of about 30 days. Um, and that is, um, not long enough for the rest of the semester so that's going to be no good so if you haven't created an account already you'll go to create account um you'll put you know what country you're from united states uh your role which will be the student you'll put high school you'll put your date of birth uh you guys were born in 2002 go next you'll input your first and last name use your style email since this isn't Education version, you want to use your my email. Confirm it. Uh, it's giving me an error because I already have an account with that email. Put your password, agree to the terms, and create an account. Uh, since I already have an account, I'll just go to sign in. Um, stay signed in. Okay, now that I'm signed in, it'll allow me, allow me to download the um, AutoCAD Mechanical. Make sure you're downloading Mechanical, not standard AutoCAD. AutoCAD Mechanical is a lot friendlier and has a lot of the tools that I'm going to be referencing uh, throughout the class. So for license type, uh, we'll go to personal or individual use. For version, we'll go to AutoCAD Mechanical 2020. Operating system, we'll go to Windows 64-bit. And language, we'll go to English. Okay, once you've selected English, it's going to uh, load like this. Scroll down. Note the file size is 4.02 gigabytes. Uh, so make sure that your computer has enough disk space for that. I'll go to install now. Uh, hit accept, install. Uh, and it'll prep the install file for you. Once that's downloaded, you'll click on that and you'll start downloading. One note as this is downloading, at some point in this process, uh, Autodesk might prompt you to um, take a picture of to take a picture of and include uh, a, a picture of your uh, student ID to prove that you are a student. Uh, some people just like is this a, is this a scam or something? Uh, it's not just you know take a picture. It's just to prove that you are a student uh, at the school, uh, and you can send that off to it. Sometimes email, sometimes on their site. It's a little bit weird the way they do it. Um, but I just want to you know assure you that it's not some weird scam or anything uh, that they do need a picture of your ID. Okay, um, then the download will take a little bit of time. Uh, the install will take a little bit of time. So what I recommend you do is just leave it open, let it do its thing. Don't uh, work on your computer during this time because it can, uh, uh, this install could crash your computer. So just kind of leave it alone, kind of like I'm doing. Okay, once it's done downloading, this is what your screen will look like. Uh, so we're going to click install on this computer. Um, and again, this will take a little while and you want to let it do its thing, not open other things because it could crash the install, it could crash your computer. Um, so just one thing at a time. Okay. You want to make sure this is checked here. Autodesk AutoCAD Mechanical 2020. Um, it might ask you to download a couple of other Autodesk things, um, but uh, I already have those installed on my computer. That's why it's not prompting me. So if it's prompting you to, to install uh, anything else at this point, you could just kind of check it and make sure that that gets installed as well, because um, you'll need those Autodesk uh, items. So yeah, this part is going to take a little bit of time. So we'll just let it do its thing. So done installing this is what it'll look like uh hit launch now just to confirm 
that the download worked and that you can open AutoCAD Mechanical. Um, it might take a moment to load. If you have other applications open, um, you might want to close them because this program does uh, take a lot to run. So you might want to just close your browser, everything uh, that you don't need uh, while you're running it. Um, and my resolution is a little off, doesn't really matter. Let's say okay, whatever. And then once this is uh, done loading, I recommend taking a little time to mess around with this. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to make a post asking you to play around with this and post a few things that you discover. Uh, so you can start messing around with it uh, right now, uh, kind of seeing how it works, uh, how you draw inside of this software. Um, so you see, how can we draw? circle, a line, some of these things might uh, look familiar. It says construction line. Here we go. Okay. Um, some of this stuff will look familiar. You see a construction line, circles. Um, you can see that you can draw stuff to specific sizes. So, um, well, that's it for today. Um, till next time, uh, Mr. Blay, uh, have a good one.